All right, hey everybody, this is Brian from PMB Homesteading. I wanted to show you the plant propagation bed where we're doing some new cuttings. So we saved off whatever the blueberries were, that because uh, blueberries are notoriously hard to propagate by using their cuttings. So I saved the four, out of all those cuttings, I only got four of them that actually looked like they're starting to take root. And so I took those out and I put those, I up potted them into some five inch pots and they're sitting out there in the, uh, over by our fire pit in kind of a shadier area. So we'll see if I can get those to survive. But right now we've got, we've got lavender and we've got azalea bush. So I took a couple of our azalea bushes, cut off a bunch of uh, cuttings. I'm gonna try and propagate those so we can put those throughout the yard. And this is all lavender here. I believe it's a French lavender. And it's got a really nice bush. And it really kind of interlaces itself when it blooms. And uh, it's got a nice, nice hanging. It's a good for hanging on a wall. So we're gonna plant a bunch of that throughout the yard for whatever ones of these cuttings I get to survive. And so I basically just took the uh, cuttings, dipped them in a little bit of the dry root hormone. I used the two that I have, the garden safe and the take root. And uh, I've got this timer set for every 10 minutes. It gives a, you know, a spray of uh, misted water for 10 seconds. And we'll see how well that goes. If it needs more water, then I can always boost it up. But uh, they look pretty good. They still look like they're pretty fresh. They've been getting sprayed, you know, this morning, and it's already getting close to uh, 80 degrees out. It's about 11 o'clock. All right, well, this, uh, you know, we'll keep you updated and each week and see how well the progress goes on the uh, plant propagation bed. All right, talk to you guys again. Bye.